Yo, hi, these comments are for NU. This is Michael from OTC, OnlineTuffleCourse.com. You are coming up. It is your turn to get 26. That is a fact. I believe this. I really believe this. It's your turn. Your turn. All right? Okay, let's get started here. Let me get the uh, speaking rubrics the integrated ones here so I can get ready. All right, so you've been practicing for over a month now. You're working on improving your delivery, your language use, topic development. You're just trying to improve your speaking so you can not only get a good score on the TOEFL exam, but so you can communicate, you know, with people in a healthcare environment. Okay, here we go. Let's listen to your practice test once and then the second time I'll give you comments. The professor in the lecture explains two ways in which advertising can negatively affect the environment. First is by wasting the natural resources such as trees. She provides an, an example of mail and says that many people don't even require mails such as kitchen renovation booklet because they don't even live in a place and instead rent it. So. Okay. Good tone. May these people end up throwing these mails in the trash, which results in wastage of paper and therefore wastage of trees. Second disadvantage is that large advertisements block the natural beauty around them. For instance, uh, billboards, huge billboards which are placed across the roads block the view of beautiful mountain area as people can fully appreciate it. And therefore, these are the two disadvantages of advertisement. The professor okay, so I think on this, I'm going to say 24 to 26. I think you had some language use issues. Now, what I want you to work on, I want you to work on creating those topic sentences when you state the first disadvantage is, or the first disadvantage according to the professor is that. So you struggle with your sentence structure there so figure out how to create better sentence formation as you're introducing the first disadvantage or the second disadvantage or the first reason the second reason so if you need some grammatical help go to the speaking part of my course I want you to check out it's called TOEFL integrated speaking strategies right that's a master lesson for integrated speaking and look through the example outlines and look at how you can create those sentences that can uh, I it, it's just awkward to say the first disadvantage or first is that that's awkward to just start off with first and try to use that as a subject because it really isn't first second third these are actually numerals numbers okay let's listen to it one more time the professor in the lecture explains two ways in which advertising can negatively affect the environment. First okay. is by wasting the natural resources such as trees. Say first, advertising wastes a lot of natural resources such as trees because of all the paper that they use to market their products or something. So you need a little bit better sentence there. She provides an, an example of mail and says that many people don't even require mails such as kitchen renovation booklet because they, they don't require mail. Just keep mail, no, no plural form there. Mail is an uncount noun. Don't even live in a place and instead rent it. So may, these people end up throwing these mails in the trash which results in wastage of paper and therefore wastage of trees a wastage of which I would just say which waste paper and which eventually waste trees I would use it like that second disadvantage is that large advertisements block the the such a disadvantage that large no secondly uh, large advertising companies block blah 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 I would say it's something like natural that. beauty around them for instance, uh, billboards, huge billboards which are placed across the roads block the view of beautiful mountain area as people can fully appreciate. 
they block the view of mountain areas and other scenic locations, you might say. Did. And therefore, these are the two disadvantages of advertisement. The yeah, I don't know. I'm going to I'm going to readjust my score there. I'm going to go down to 23 to 25 on this one. So I think you're having some language use issues in this response as you're trying to explain the the ideas. I don't think that your sentence style is the best that it can be. All right. So if you need some help on that, I think I already told you earlier, go to Integrated Speaking Strategies, Master Lesson, and then look at the example outlines for the four speaking tasks. Think about how you can use that to help you uh, organize your ideas.